Good day, viewers. You are welcome once again to your favorite program, The Conversation, coming to you from TV360 here in Lagos, Nigeria. My name is Nelson Ekujumi, and I have with me in the studio Richard Adeyinkai Manuel. Richie, you are welcome to the program. Thank you. Yes, uh, you are, like we all know, the conversation is a topical issues uh, around Nigeria and as well as in the diaspora. We look at current happenings and we bear our minds, you know, unhindered, unfettered. You, you, I, I, we discuss this issue so that the viewers can make informed decisions so that they can become better educated. Well, uh, on this, uh, on this uh, stanza of the program, we, we're going to look at uh, the flooding in Maduguri. Uh, it's one that uh, when the news broke, we didn't expect that level of flooding. I don't think I've even seen that type of flooding anywhere Unprecedented, in my really. life. And uh, when the figures started coming out, it was a major national calamity. About two million people, people have been, been displaced already. Over 30, people, over 30 yeah. dead. Yeah. That, those are those we can still we can account, see account for. for. You know, animals, 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 you know. Properties worth billions destroyed. So, very devastating. Uh, honestly, honestly. And uh, we must commend Nigerians. We must commend Mr. President. We must commend the government of Bono State. Mr. President even had to break uh, his international tour yeah. to come and come through. That shows you the level of uh, importance he attaches to the plight of his citizens. However, beyond the visit yeah. of Mr. President, Mr. President should query, because it is that allowed them mm. that caused this... It overflowed. Yes. But it has been detected over 10 years ago that it has structural yeah, But defect. it didn't collapse. It didn't collapse, it but it has structural defects in which over 400 million had been budgeted, budgeted for. for it. But we don't know whether that budget had for been... Whether that's like 2020, uh, 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 Richard, up till this budget, R Richard. Ministry of Water Resources was budgeting for this dam. I will tell you for free. For the structural uh, defects to be corrected. Richard, I will tell you for free. It's just like when we talk about turnaround maintenance of our refineries. Yes. Several budgets have been made for it. But, but no there's a difference released. between budget and actual release. He has to tell us that no money has been as, released uh, uh, yet uh, uh, yes. until we have that in public Before, domain. So you, yes, I agree. We, yes. Uh, what we know is that when you know uh one you go we tell her cooking paro, paro, yeah. you know when you have Something been foretold, foretold yeah. you should you should prepare yes, for it yes. now you have discovered that this dam has structural defect that needed to be corrected now what did you do budgeted money for it 2020 2021 2022 no and i agree i agree with you, so with you the president he said we can't blame anybody that it is natural. Natural occurrence. No. No. Yes, we can't rule out the natural angle to uh, yes. it. But the human factors uh, okay. also must be investigated. And anybody found culpable should be punished. Because this is what we do in this part of the world. We, 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 we shield people who have done wrong from being punished. No, we, we shield people whom we don't have the facts yet. Not even when we have facts. No, we, we should. Shield the, those in government and it's an elite conspiracy. Elites defend themselves. They shield themselves. Don't worry. But, like what you have said now, sir. the argument may come later that although money had been budgeted, but it has not been released. Uh, that is why the defense could not be corrected. That is not what we are saying. What we are saying is that two million lives have been displaced. Their lives distorted forever. Some may not recover. Properties that have been damaged and all. So we never know our little, little actions. Yeah. What yeah. we... Will it translate to? So this is, this is rather so sad. Whoever is found, that is how to know a government that is serious or a president that is also serious. Tackle it. When somebody well, has committed, either the, the, the minister 
or whoever is in charge. Maybe money has been released and somebody has just pocketed it. Or when you release money, this one will collect its shares. That one will collect its shares. Everybody will share it. And what you will have left will not be able to do the job for which the money was budgeted. Well, uh, so the president should go beyond just commiseration. Find, find out what happened. If you have found that this is defective and money, a minister or a ministry has deemed need fit to correct that defect, why has it not been effective? Well, uh, Richard, the information we had when that incident happened was that the dam collapsed. Then the federal ministry Sir, came out and collapse. said the dam didn't collapse. Then we started hearing that the dam had structural defect, that the dam was built between 1984 and 86. 86 yeah. so, so that means the dam is almost about uh, 40 years old. Sure. So for me, I also recognize that um, the Bono State government before now had issued notices to its uh, citizens and residents because they said there was excessive rainfall in that part of the country. Mm -hmm. So this issue of climate change, it's also a, an opportunity to tell ourselves some basic truth. Climate change is real. It is. That is why today you cannot, meteorologists cannot predict oh, when it will happen. rain or not, mm. when the sun, you know. So I think it is important for us to take climate change seriously. Then, like you have rightly said, I agree that that incident must be investigated. But we Very should not important. run, you know, when an incident happens, you start hearing all sorts of stories. Yes. So we expect that as we are more concerned with providing succor to the people, we must also be ready to investigate it such that we won't have a recurrence. And then prevent future Yes, elsewhere. So it's important. Just this morning, I heard that the House of Representatives has donated 100 million. Uh, plenty, plenty, so plenty, many people. And... <laughs> <laughs> that has also brought brought the issue of people's uh, desperation, either for survival or to, or to just grab anything they can grab. The people that were not even affected, they have <laughs> they have found they have, they have the found camp, with the, <laughs> the temporary camp for the victim, <laughs> and they are part of they are sharing they are, they part, will of, be part the of the largest. beneficiaries. The <laughs> governor has been lamenting that. Ah, ah, but the people that, <laughs> that are not affected, they are here now sharing the, whatever it is. You know, that is the... That's the human thing. element for you. <laughs> you know, some people want to profit. From other people's what misfortune. Misfortune. As, a, as Nigerians, we I don't think do it better. is only in Nigeria it happens, though. No. But it is not, it's not something we should be happy about. Yes. It's but, condemnable. But, but, but perhaps if you find, if, uh, those who find themselves in a... In a Awkward in a, situation. Yes, where they have to struggle for survival. They have to, you know, be desperate. Where they to, cannot leave their heads on I their beds any longer. You, they will... If, I, if you open it in Lagos, you will find people who are not affected. <laughs> people will come from other states, Papa, to be part of it. You know, it was <laughs> just like uh, there's a uh, program we attended and uh, we were discussing about uh, the Lagos State uh, owned their uh, 25% uh, food <laughs> yes. stop discount. Uh -huh. And some persons were lamenting that people are coming from outside Lagos. Yes. I said, so long as they are human beings. Yeah, because yeah. the program is not for only Lagos <laughs> residents that yeah. we say you must be ready. The program is for Nigerians. If you can come if from you can anywhere come, so to long buy, as, yeah, so buy, that is it. Because everybody is going through the same you know, economic... And like, like still, still on Lagos issue, you see that government will provide built schools, equipped schools, trained teachers, and all of that for poor people, children of poor people who cannot pay. But what, once they see, like model schools, once they see that this school has standard, is this and that, even the people who can afford to pay millions in their private schools, they will withdraw their children and you will find them in those model schools. And when they want to do open day, you will see jeeps will be parking. And this thing is meant for children of the, the poor. poor. But the rich won't let the poor bring... Well, uh, 
Uh, this uh, happening is 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 a human. It is, is human. It, it is so human. We the, can't really the doubt. The incident <laughs> in uh, Bono State is uh, regrettable. Unfortunate. It's unfortunate. Uh, we commiserate with the government yeah, so. people of Bono State, and uh, we call on Nigerians as well as uh, people in diaspora to please let us lend the helping hand yeah. to these our brothers and sisters Very who are going key. through hard times. You can yeah. imagine in these economic times when you have to lose your home lose your properties. Yeah. I'm sure some of those persons there, uh, they, they, some of them will have lost their relatives that they cannot. Uh, uh, they can't even account uh, for. Uh, account they for they because know, everybody, yeah. <laughs> when anything happens, everybody's camp for, for safety. Uh, well, uh, we, we usually say that uh, um, self-preservation ah. is the first law of humanity. You must burn. You, you, you first of all run for your dear life. Before so, you think of so, uh, a child the, or a yes, brother or... Uh, the, the, the rescue and emergency services have their work cut out. Uh, we and say they have, so far, they have performed. They have done very well. We the say response, big kudos to you guys. The response guys, has yes. been Has been fantastic, yes. You know, so we can we only continue them. to support you and yeah. pray for you yeah. that um, we'll continue to get better. Yeah. And um, we hope that uh, the authorities will look at the dams all over the country. All over. The, it's important. So it's that uh, we won't have a situation whereby a dam is overrun. Uh, and uh, we know that uh, when accidents happen, mm. the magnitude cannot be measured. At all. <laughs> so it's better, like uh, they say in medicine, prevention is better than cure. Very, very. It's, it's cheaper. Very cheap. <laughs> it's, it's, so I think uh, the authorities will do the same now that uh, we have had this uh, the calamity we have to ensure that it doesn't reoccur. We have to ensure that those who are displaced, because um, a lot of things could come out from this displacement. Mm -hmm. Some of them could resort to mental health uh, issues. Uh, for sure. Uh, for uh, sure. Uh, there could be an uh, outbreak of water bond Many diseases. people will uh, not now, recover. Yes. Even if they have not died now. Yes. But what will happen later from the mental uh, aspect, depression. Yes. You know, um, when I saw the pictures, I could not very just imagine human beings passing through this. Through this, and it's, uh, it's a sad it's situation. Sad. We hope that we, uh, all of us, including government, we will work to prevent such occurrences occurrence in every part of Nigeria. Of country, so that yes. we, it is a sad uh, and gory yes. Yes. sight. So yes, I agree able. with you. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this is where we want to call it a wrap on this first stanza of the program, the conversation. We'll go on a short break. We'll be right back. Please continue to watch the conversation on TV 360. We'll be right back.